Good morning guys. Welcome to a very, very stressful day. Today is the day we have to decide. By the end of this vlog, we'll have a horse or we won't have a horse. So let's start this day and figure it all out. Guys, look at my boots. I've been praying for cold weather in the mornings, you guys. New shoes! <laughs> covered in mud. Yeah. Do not walk down the way that Dad and I walk down because we'll be up to here with um watery mud. Very watery yeah, mud. Yeah, it like sucks your foot it's in. It's water, but then it's mud. Yeah. Good morning, Willow. It sucks your foot in like water. Are you ready for the possibility of a brother? What are we gonna do with all these jumps? If we buy this horse, we are probably gonna bring him home. Possibly, I don't know. I haven't even called our barn where Storm is yet to see if they have room for him. So, oh God, look what's happening. Like, well, we can always move people are, oh. I learned so many things in this journey so far and I want to explain like, oh. to you all of it in a second. But before I do, look at this. Show you that I was a mess. So you were shrugging your shoulders. Look at the arena. I know. Like we have a barn we can't even get to. So it's still a bit hilly. That stuff over there is still frozen. Like it's still frozen, you guys. Ooh. Yesterday when we were in town, I was so struck by the fact that there's spring there and there's not that much spring here other than the mud. Good Yesterday girl. Yesterday she ran me over when I tried to stop her, so. But today she got a lesson. No, yesterday she got a lesson. We're All right, let her go. Go. She's like, whoa, look at the arena. I'll go in there, Dad. <laughs> Always working. Always behind the doors. Always behind the door, ready to scare the ponies. I told you soon enough, everything started to change. No going back, no going back. There's no going back to your own life. Not living in the past, we're over that. I'm feeling it tonight, riding on the dizzying. Oh. Wow, this stall is a lot longer than all the rest. It's a lot bigger. Even though it's kind of like a dungeon. Poor storm. Nobody is allowed in this stall or to use those red buckets until Stormy Boy comes home and that's gonna be a while because we are not even ready for anything. So, we are headed to pick up our pony. No, just joking. <laughs> we were planning to go and try the pony this morning but the person who's selling him uh, had to be away. So, uh, we are going first thing tomorrow morning and we're gonna have to make a quick decision because somebody else is coming in the afternoon to try that pony. Other people are coming to see that horse tomorrow. I've done a lot of talking, a lot of thinking. Sam and I were up at 5 a.m. trying to figure out if this is the right horse for us. And he was so uh, quiet for not being ridden for a really long time and just throwing a saddle on him and just getting on him. And safe is what we're after. So if it goes well tomorrow, we'll have to make a decision. So you guys are gonna wanna stay tuned. This weekend is gonna be a busy weekend. Um, but for right now, we are headed into town to do a little bit more shopping to get our house finished. And then we need to devote some time to Storm today because poor Storm has been neglected and Gabby has been heartbroken. It has not been her fault, it has been our fault and she needs to go and spend some good quality time with that boy. Hi guys, we're at TSC, you can see in the background. And I'm here to get these LED lights because I need to put more lights in our barn and they better have them because every time and Gabby wants to look at Schleich, but anytime, every time I come here to look There's for these awesome. lights, they never have any. I mean, they were putting the... Ah! Oh, oh. Book your bees. It says book your bees. What? It says book your bees. What did you find? Kids are going crazy. They found a 10 foot cord. How much are they? 9.99. 10 bucks. I say get it. Uh huh. I want. I say get one. Yeah. Are these things? Would be like that style. 
Yeah, okay, yeah, that would be it. Yeah, yeah so any other one is just the basic iPhone. Okay, yeah. yeah. Oh, because there's two types there. <laughs> so, the green one. The green tab and the white tab for you. What are you getting? What are you getting? Oh my god, I don't know. I can pick Oh my god, three. you're so confusing. Oh, you between I got a good color three. right here. I like blue. Oh, it matches your coat. Can I get a pink and blue? No, you can one get one. Car, nope. One for... Nope. Okay. Hurry up and pick one or you're not going to get any. Blue, you're going for blue too? Confusing. Sure. Gold? Nah. White? Which color like, would you choose? Should we do an Instagram? A poll between two of them then. No, just hurry up and pick one. Come on. We don't have time for a poll. I'm just trying to get lights. All right, I'm going to leave I you here blue. and we'll see what you look like after. I want blue. Blue. All right. Oh, I see your empty racks. Every time I come here. Yeah. They have nothing. That's right. The flyer. Nothing, yep. yes. And, and no rain checks. All oh, those are them there? Yeah, these are the ones here, but all these have been opened. All right, we got our lights. We got three of them at least. We never have them there, and hopefully they'll right up our barn really nice. We just got home, and I'm sitting in the car, and I'm standing here, or I'm sitting here staring out at the mess that is our yard. And I'm realizing that these two trees are going to be amazing this summer. And all this is going to be seeded very soon and it's going to be a big huge circle of grass in the middle of our yard. But what if we put the outdoor arena right here? I mean it's already ripped up, torn up, a big huge mess. And the driveway is going to go down around and then back up here. So it would be surrounded by the driveway. What do you guys think of that? Oh my gosh, I think that's such a good idea. Does she look different? She seems different to me. Like her face. Oh, I think she just touched the fence. But look at her face, she looks so different. Still, put your face up there. Put your face up. She's trying to smell what's in my bowl. She's cantering. Yeah. Uh, Wanna join up? Head down. Now she's going down. You're doing join up? Kind of. I was trying when you guys were out of the house. Thank you. Kathleen's after. She's like, what? Hello, Willow. Oh, If we get another horse this weekend, oh, it looks beaded up there. Look at it, you guys. I like it. So do you have to go in the stall to turn them on though? No, it'll all be hooked up by the lights. Ooh. So, power so look, this could be the stall of our new horse. I love it. I actually really like that stall. It's so bright. Yeah, so, yeah, so he got one for there, one for Willow's. And Stella and Storm have light during the day, but those are stalls are like dark. So things are happening. But you know what else is happening? So much mud. Like our yard is yeah, like it's bad. It's really bad, and we can't get anybody in to do anything to it until it dries up. Like no trucks. Like you can't just bring a truck down here. And Stella is standing there. She's like, "What's happening?" <laughs> oh, she's so pretty. Wow. Looks so different. Our barn looks so different. Sam, you look so different. I hugged Sam today. 
and my arms went all the way around his whole body and I was like, whoa, what the heck? He's half the man he used to be. So, um, our instructor has a wedding tomorrow and she was gonna come with us to ride the Palomino Pony um, again and there's just no way. Like she has a wedding, blah, blah, blah. So we're gonna do it on Sunday. We're gonna go there on Sunday. Somebody else is supposed to come and see the horse tomorrow afternoon, but um, he said he'll hold him for us and we're gonna go and see him on Sunday. So um, video up maybe Sunday night, maybe Monday morning. I don't know how that's gonna work, but uh, yeah, like this could really be it. I was waiting and waiting and waiting for a sign from God. Sam and I were up at 5 a.m. Both of us couldn't sleep. Both of us were stressed out and then I just felt like this huge amount of peace come over me and I had to remind myself, Sam reminded me like we just need to trust our trainer because we love her and we do trust her and this is it though. This is it. There will be no more horse buying ever again for so long. Like not for a really, really long time. It's a really stressful process so stressful but all I want is for my girl to have a horse that she feels comfortable on that she can tack up and go and ride and be with her friends and spend time so that's the goal that's the plan hopefully it all works out according to plan but you guys will see we'll all see together Debbie I feel like you've like changed colors a hundred times in the last year can you guys guess what color Gabby is in love with now yellow I've always been in love with yellow yes when you were when you were a little tiny girl, I asked you what your favorite color was. Your very first favorite color on earth was of yellow. Of course it's not pink because... Yeah. I, I love pink. Now watch how she moves, but she's being an angel. She is an angel. We misnamed her. Look how I tied her up. Yeah, we misnamed this girl. She should have been called Angel. Yeah, she chose the name Stella. That's what we feel like. Damn, Stella means yeah. star. And you guys, she could surprise you. Our barn where Storm is, if we get that horse for Sophie, then he will go there, but they do not have any openings until April the 1st. So he will come here first for a couple of days and then go there. I don't know what it's gonna be like with three horses in this barn. So good. Yeah, I know. She, I, I, I step away from my horse. This is gonna be a battle for years. Horse. Yeah, you're making her good for me. I know. She's all of our horse. Willow normally does not grab Willow doesn't that. normally like to be... Look at that. She doesn't usually just stand still. She's changed a lot. I do not know what it would be like to throw a boy in the mix, though. Storm's the boss. The storm is a brat. Make a run for that. Like, I'm not even... That's I can't even tell you. Storm is a brat. I when know he gets that to Willow... The boss, when he's the boss, he acts like he's a stallion. He says, oh! Fight me, I'm the boss. Square up. <laughs> Square up. Square. I just realized something. The, the girls are working out there. Sam is working in here. And I'm working out in the tack area. It's a Friday afternoon. And this is what we're doing to be like together as a family. Like we're, we're all, yeah, we still have to go to the other bar. But we're, we're all like hanging out as a family working. We're all working on different things together. What's gonna happen with this bow when this barn is done? You guys are probably all laughing. Any of you guys who own barns are probably laughing and saying, Laura, it's never gonna be done. Probably not. I'm just cleaning off that shelf, putting some polo wraps out. I found a bunch of lunging ropes. I tried to stick all the saddle pads over here. I could not get them all, but Sam did order more of these things, so that's gonna work. So you were shrugging your shoulders and clothes. That's what I told you soon enough Everything started to change Cause there's no going back No going back There's no going back to your own life Not living in the past We're over that I'm feeling it tonight Riding on the dizzying heights
Nothing could stop us Sunsets, remember the colors They were wrong It was way more than a dream We climbed up Yeah, over the hillside It's alright We stood there all wide-eyed You and I Floating on air in my mind Cause there's no going back No going back There's no going back to you so uh, Gabby was gonna ride Storm, but now he's cut. He just looks like a mess. So oh, we decided not to ride him. Glad we came because it's gonna be really cold again tonight. <laughs> so we wanted to change his blanket, but yeah. The... And he has a big cut. Look in the shape of a heart. That's a huge one. Like I can't, oh man. I never wanna have a, uh, another leg wound again on a horse. This is the worst. I don't know when we're going to be able to ride him again. No, it's going to have to go like right here. Yeah, don't put it too close to his water bug bucket. So, so Gabby got his, finally. Right there. It looks better. Up here? No, here. She got it for Christmas, and now she's finally getting it on his stall. I replaced the licket. Yeah, she didn't, he didn't like the licket Storm that was in there. Storm is a carrot boy. Yeah, he did not like the apple one. He likes the carrot no. one. So the girls are getting all their stuff for Here tomorrow, for Sunday. I have a pony. So I don't know if it's just that he knocked the, for the top layer of skin off and that's the problem. So I don't know, like, it's annoying, it's annoying. Ugh. It gets a lot of stress having a, having a hurt horse. I wish he could be on stall rest. Stall rest would be so much better because even though it would be hard for him, he'd at least be able to heal. We're bringing our light blue bucket home. Light blue saddle pad. Is that the color of the new horse if we get him? Yes, and all different colors. You're going to have him a rainbow horse? Welcome to a country living. I can't even look. I caught it. Oh, it's humanely destroyed. Oh, that's horrible. My cat doesn't do nothing. I'm oh, that is horrible. I didn't see it. Let's see. Poor little mouse. So sad. Yeah, that's terrible. We need get traps. Log traps. That the animals can stay alive because I don't want to kill them. So we can put them back outside and they can come back in again. And we'll just do it over and over and over Sorry. again. Make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.